back at it again. Um, so what was I doing last time? What do we do? I exposed Tino Balducci. I got a bunch of items. Found Lori. Uh, I don't remember what happened with John. Figured out that his show was getting canceled, but only because it was moving up to a major network. Um, there's beef between Grumpy Old Lady and Lori. Lori's mad that Grumpy Old Lady stole some of her, some of Lori's story stuff. Um, party boys are fulfilling an assistant role to me, basically doing some research. Hey, how's it going? Balducci wants me to share everything I find out about Jake Hurley with him. I'll bet he does. Balducci wants to find out He just doesn't want you stuff. to show him up again. Yeah, he wants you to do all the legwork so at the last minute, BAM! He can swoop in and grab all the credit. Yeah. I wouldn't tell him a thing, Nance. Unless it's to get lost. Hell yeah, Frank and Joe. Talk to you later. If you need anything, just let us know. So I think at some point... Train's like supposed train to stop stops. in Copper Gorge, but maybe I need to talk to everybody first. More questions? I'll touch bases with you later. Let me know if you run across anything juicy. I don't know why she's here. What could she possibly have to offer me in terms of assistance? I'm not your mother. Too tired, that's what Alice said. I don't know how to order them. Or maybe that was already told to me. I know that in the letters, it, in one of the letters it says something. Map, projector, and... Oh, wait. Uh, I've stored his name accordingly. Holds a warm place in my heart. Warm. Uh, name of their maker. Wearing the shoes before her favorite step. It's from my beloved Camille. She has four words for you. Words which when translated into numbers and used in combination will help power my projector. So I have to go to Copper Gorge and then... Rub... <laughs> <laughs> rub, rub something off. Um, okay. Wait, let's go back. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, that's the stuff. What's going on? How come you told me you and Lori never went out, and she told me you did? Ooh. Don't you ever stop asking questions? When people start answering them honestly, I do. <sighs> My dumpster, okay? I'm not proud of what I did. I'm not happy about what I did, but it's done. It's over. Now let's drop it. Why did she invite him back on the train? If you didn't want to dump her, why did you? You are incredibly irritating, you know that? I dumped her because... Because people said going out with her would make me look bad. Said she was a joke. That no one took her seriously. Said if I started hanging with her, no one would take me seriously. So I stopped calling. That's not what I want to ask, because that was Did very you ever selfish tell Lori of them. Any of this? No. Now take a powder. I don't feel like talking anymore. I've never heard that phrase before. Alright, let's talk to Lori. So I don't think I can really do anything. Honestly. Yes? I'll come back later. As soon as you figure it out, let me know. Figure out what? Well, I've exhausted most of the dialogue options. Let me go back to John. Let's see what he's got. Otherwise, I want to be really sad trying to figure out what to do. Stop. I won't keep you any longer. Goodbye. Because I do know 
that at some point the train's supposed to stop in Copper Gorge. And I don't know when that is supposed to happen. Hey, how's it going? See you later. You better. Uh, I don't know what to do. Okay. Compass, shoes, thermometer, tune to tell the truth, but where? I've already figured that all out. This projector stuff. Finding Lori first really paid off. Maybe I need to go look at the note again. Uh, map. I don't have the map. Know that my travels have taken me all over this country, which could be difficult to find. Calico, Silverado. Are these all, are those letters important? Oh, no, no. Do I have the means through which I can figure out what I need to, to click on in that weird puzzle box with letters? Or am I stuck again? Do I need to pause? So I know I can't do anything with the weights. I know that there are things that I can do if certain events were triggered, such as getting to Amethyst, such as playing the piano, but I really don't know what I to need do. A pickaxe. I think the pickaxe is in, well as uh, Frank and Joe said, it was in Copper Gorge, so what's a boy to do? I need a spyglass. If I had a lamp, this is where I'd put it. And that's where the map would go, I think, according to the schematic. And I don't have uh, all the gems, so I can't do anything here. This does something, but I don't know what. I want more hints. I'm dumb. These dolls are supposed to be meaningful. This one talks. Mama. <sighs> so you can swap them around. And I really feel like that gets at the... Gets in this part. So I'm able to find out um, I'm able to figure out which dolls these are because I've like heard the the stories and stuff um, I've, I've like seen a bunch of them already um, unlike the slips of paper and you know that that thing behind the 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 container in the in John Gray and Camille's room. Um, this thing, uh, this doll with the two discolored eyes. She, this is the one with the sickness, uh, for instance. So, 
These have been referenced previously. I just don't know what that means. Do I put them in... What, what kind of order is it? Is it alphabetical order? How do I know? How do I learn? Is there anything to click like this? No. Okay, maybe it's time to take another break and uh, figure out what exactly I need to do because I'm lost again. Okay, so I was told that I, I had to figure out uh, this puzzle related to the to the places here, um, which I had figured, but I didn't know what exactly to do. Maybe I should like I need to just try stuff more. Um, I'm always afraid to be doing it wrong. So I think, yeah, what I did in order to make those blocks disappear was uh, I just typed out calico. But now I need to find Silverado. Yeah. matter? Send... no. Central City. There we go. What's the other one? Dodge City. City and Tombstone. Guess I'm done. Strange. All that's left is a jumble of letters. N B R Z T B A A. Okay. Can't touch it. Said eight letters, I think. Uh, and the R Z T A A. Whips. Oh, it's so cool. Yeah. It's map time, Jake's baby. Mind must be somewhere on this map, but where? I don't know. It's probably going to be related to the spyglass and the lamp and all of that that I have to figure out. Before you say anything, I just want to say thank you. Oh, you're welcome. For what? Tino came to see me. He said you'd made him realize what a jerk he'd been for dumping me, and then he asked me out. No. Isn't that great? He said 
he doesn't care what anybody else thinks. He thinks we make the perfect couple. No. Well, I can't argue with him there. So what do you want? Guess I better get to work. I'll uh... be waiting. Well, cool. I got the map now. I still don't know what to do with the dolls. Yeah, tell Tino I found a map. Ah, I can't stay mad at a fellow detective. What do you need? It's been great talking to you. Anything for a fellow detective. We're gonna talk to Frank and Joe again. How's it going? Uh, Talk to you later. If you need anything, just let us know. Okay, how did I learn all about the Sadie Crawford? How did I learn all about the the dolls? Who told me about that? Book on samplers. It was after that. How to identify gemstones. Draw in the caboose. Box colors. Pipes. Connect all the pipes. Lori's hiding in the caboose. Everything that's needed is on the train or with Camille in her grave. So shut shut toy aunt. Shimmering socks. How does that help me give the dolls an order? I, I agree, how does that help me? What's the order of the dolls? I know that Sadie Crawford is one of the dolls. But is it alphabetical order? Maybe I need to write these down. Let me, let me find a pen. Was terrible. We have Sadie, who has no shoes. Um, let's go to Camille's room and look at that paper. And have it'll tell me which one the multicolored eye doll is. Nope. 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 S sickly Sarah. Uh. 
Well, that's just four of them. What about the rest? Oh, here's here's two. Camille with Hager Anderson and Chantilly Hildegard. Hager. Spenders. Chantilly. Hildegard. Um, I don't know, she's got like braids or something. So that's six, baby. What else? What else? I don't know what that rumbling is. Oh, Eliza has a red ribbon. Okay. And there was that rumbling. What was that rumbling that knocked around the thing? I want to click on it. Ugh. Whatever. Is there something that I missed in, in this room? Who is Ruth Kensington? Who is this guy? in here again? I don't remember. So one without shoes? Or am I reading too much into this? has given me no sense of what order that they should be in. And also there are, what is it, 11 dolls? And I've only found out things related to maybe eight of them. I think that one is the Eliza. Mama. I haven't heard anything related to a doll that can talk. Maybe I just don't know things yet. Maybe I need to go back and talk to the Hardy Boys one more time. I don't even... Yeah. Maybe I'll... Pause it and try and figure this out again. I've got the map. That's worth something. 
Mm. Hey, how's it going? Talk to you later. You know where to find us. What's with the tinkling? I'm lost. I'm gonna die. I'm going to die. No. And there's that one mechanism with the numbers. Uh, there are four numbers that I need to put in there. I don't know what those numbers are. I don't know how to get them. I don't know... I don't know anything. What's going on? Thanks for your help. Helping people is what I'm all about. <sighs> Alright, I'm gonna, I'm gonna save this, because I'm about to have a panic attack. Alright, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pause this, and just figure out what I need to do, because I'm, I'm fully stumped on the dolls. I know that they need to go in a particular order, because they can be moved around, and I know how to identify some of them, but I don't know how to identify all of them, and also... Uh... I don't, I don't know how to identify, like, probably five or six of them. Um, but also, I have no idea what order they're supposed to be in. I don't, like, I could just start putting them in an alphabetical order, but again, I don't know all of their names. And I don't know how to find their names either. So, I, I'm, I'm stumperooned. Um, so, I will, I will be right back. Okay, I'm back again. Um, yeah, there were uh, things that I didn't remember looking at, and then also things that uh, things that I haven't spotted yet. Such as here. This is Naughty Camille. Or the one Camille calls Naughty. Naughty Tina. Uh, that's a doll. Um, I think I didn't put two and two together. Because some of these dolls have last names and some of them have descriptors. Which is really weird. Um, and then there's some in Joe and Gray's car still. Um, so there's this one. I forgot about Awful Ursula there. So that was woven in. There's also uh, this box right here. Teddy Didn't know. Eberhardt. Teddy Eberhardt. Um, but they all have two names. Uh, or like two two words in their, their name at the very least. Uh, so that's significant. And it's significant because where do the dolls retrieve his name? I'll have to give the dolls an order. This will require Camille's dancing shoes for the name of their ma their their maker. Um, so she, the name of her dancing shoes is related to the order of the dolls. 
which means that Chaussette Chateauant is somehow related to the order of these dolls. Um, and all the dolls have two names, and if I remember correctly, is that 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12? Just 12? No, wait, it's 11. Did I name some multiple times? I don't remember. Oh, there we go. Yawning Alice. Terrible Edna. Um. Uh, Chantilly Hildegard goes first because those initials CH are the first in Chaussette. So, uh, wishy bear. F uh, I, I don't know. Um, what did that letter say? Or what did that image have? Let me go back. Because it's right here. It's very easy. She had shoes, and it looks like a. It looks like she has the. The gems, the necklace. Write it down. I'm just writing down the letters. Chaussette. Sh at. Toy. Aunt. There we go. Okay. Oh, this is difficult. Oh wait, I forgot why I walked in that room. Oh no, it was to find out the 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 thing. Um, yeah, it's Chantilly Hildegard. She have braids? Oh no, she doesn't have braids, damn it. Yawning Earth, whatever. Yawning Alice. Um, sh I need AU, what is that? It means I need awful Ursula. Mama. No. Is there a mean one? Like an unambiguously mean one. Oh, does she have red hair? There's a there is an image of her. In the room with the uh, the sampler.
Yeah. Red hair, yellow dress. While I'm here, is there anything I can figure out about Tomasino O'Neill? That's like black hair. I don't feel like she's the only one with black hair, though. Teddy looks like, but I do know what Hager Anderson looks like, so. Or I should know. Oh, 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 oh. He's like a good little suspenders boy. Good suspenders boy. Super hard. If I didn't have access to the internet, I would be throwing myself at this for several days. Okay. Uh, awful Ursula. Red hair, yellow dress. SS. Sickly Sarah with the the eyes. I think that's this is Thomas. Who is that? Thomasina? No. Uh, Et. There's like all. There's only one with an E. I don't. I don't know Eliza's last name. That's her. T E. Teddy Eberhart. Is that like a Scottish name or something? Maybe. Um, well, that's the only other, like, masculine coded doll here, so that's what I'm going with. Uh, SC is Sadie Crawford, who is missing shoes. But at the same time, is not sleepy. H A. Hey, Randerson, the good suspenders boy. T O. Thomasino O'Neill. She's got the black hair. Naughty Tina has an injury. Um. Yawning. Oh. Yes. Yes, need to. Uh, oh, I missed one. Maybe I switch her with Eliza? Uh, uh. Did I misspell something? Yes. Shut do I yawn? I did not. Alright, let me let me just spawn one more. Okay, let's do this one more time. Um 
This first one is Chantilly Hildegard, who's already there. Um, second one is Awful Ursula. Bang. Third one is Sickly Sarah. Mama. Ugh. Sickly Sarah. Um, number four is Edna the Terrible. Um, Mama. Which is apparently this one. Um, not Terrible Edna. Mama. Uh, so, yeah, it's just, it's very confusing to me. Um, but number five is Teddy Everhart. Uh, number six is Sadie Crawford, the doll that does not have shoes but is awake. Seven is Hager Anderson. Eight is Thomasina O'Neill. Who has black hair. It's the only one left. Um, nine is Yawning Alice. Ten is Naughty Tina. And eleven was Eliza. Oh, goody! Give me those. Hell yes. Oh, that's cute. Hats. Weird hats. Fox hunting. Okay. Well, I now have all these, which is good. And now I can do the thing with the box and the... the the duck over here. If I can figure out how to do that. Alright, I'm gonna save this. Okay. Got duck. Both those lit at the same time, but not all screwy. Okay. Oh, 
I can't lift the one off. It's, it's right there. It's Let me go look at the. Let me look at the sampler again. And make sure I'm not misremembering. I need box and duck. Duck, one. Box, four. Do I need to use all of them to ensure that I have enough? Duck is one. With any luck, I just opened the stove in the dining car. What? How? I was doing it. What? What is this? I don't understand. I don't get it. Yeah, you open the stove, whatever. I'm... I got one so many times using all of the things, and I don't... I don't understand. Am I not supposed to use all of them? Do I have to only... Do I have to use an equal amount of stones on both sides? I don't get it. Whatever, I'm opening the stove now. James Thurston. Nine dollars a week plus room and board in exchange for his services as the engineer of my train. James Thurston. All right, cool. What do we got? Hey, how's it going? I think I know the name of Jake Hurley's engineer, James Thurston. Great. What else do you know about him? Well, nothing. That's it. Good. Good. Yeah, finding out more about him will give us something to do. We'll look into it. Okay. Now See what do you I in do? a bit. You know where to find us. What, what did I get? Oh, I got the... I got all those things. Maybe I can do the eagle now. Okay. Tinkle, tinkle, tinkle. 
You should really talk to grumpy old lady. Look, I, I, I did notes. I noted up when figuring out those dolls. I used my own brain power. More questions? I'll touch bases with you later. That would be nice. I don't... It's locked. <laughs> You done over here, nerd? What's up? I'll let you get back to work. Come back anytime. I really want to play this piano. Please don't. Eagle, two. I have to end up with two. How does he do it? I don't know. Not no. Oh wait. <laughs> Can I even? I don't, I do not understand. But that's okay. You don't always need to understand. Yes? I'll come back later. I don't as know what else to solve. As soon as you figure solve. it out, let me know. I figured out this. I don't know what this is supposed to mean at all. There's really nothing else to click on there. Found out the name of the engineer. Found the map. Not quite sure what else to do. Um, but in light of that, I think that this is a good stopping point um, because I've I've stopped and started so much, and I think that we've we've gotten gotten a few things done, uh, but. I might need to might need to think a little bit more or might need to fumble around here and try to try to get it whatever I'm supposed to do next so uh, I appreciate you uh, sitting with me watching me fumble around but that is how puzzle games go and of course I'm gonna cut out a lot of space here um, so that not all of it is uh, just me like sitting here thinking um, so uh, thank you for watching. Uh, I hope that I'll be able to make 
big strides next time. But yeah, sometimes it's slow going. Can't solve all the easy ones first and uh, just blow through the hard ones later. So uh, yeah, thank you for joining me. And until next time.